Hey campers, this is Patrick with Uncle Bill's Camping and today we're going to be taking a look at a fairly new product from Jetboil and that is the Jetboil Mighty Mo. So this is actually kind of like a stripped down version of the regular Jetboil burner that comes with uh, the Flash or the regular Jetboil cup or you know the Jetboil Java. Uh, to give you an idea of what I'm talking about. This is the actual burner that comes with uh, Jetboil Flash. This is something I've had for uh, quite a few years and it's very, very reliable. And you can see it actually has this metal lip right here that's made to actually hook onto the bottom of the cup here and heat up this flux ring. And uh, that's, the, that's the whole reason that Jetboils heat up so fast. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this out of the package here in a second and we're gonna put it, uh, not necessarily side by side, but we are gonna do a comparison to see how it heats up water, see if it actually heats up as fast and to uh, get a better look at it and uh, you know, make an informed decision on uh, whether this is something that you wanna get for yourself. All right guys, uh, we've just taken a look inside the box here and uh, what I've noticed is that we have uh, instruction manuals uh, or actually one very large instruction manual looks like in several different languages of course you get a jet boil sticker we also have a, a small bag actual stove itself and a, a small stabilizer pedestal that you put on the bottom of your butane canister now that actually comes with the uh, the jet boil flash also almost all the, uh, the jet boil stoves will give you one of these to uh, be able to stabilize the base of your uh, your butane canister which is a good thing all right guys so we uh, we got everything out of the uh, the wrapper here and we're going to take a little bit of a look at this and uh, kind of compare the two now at first look it looks like it's really just a uh, a stripped down version of the uh, the actual jet boil base but upon further inspection you can actually see that your uh, your top burner here actually is um, a little bit bigger and uh, you know that goes a long way when you're actually cooking now the other thing is also this is rated at 4500 BTUs this is rated at 10,000 BTUs, so I'm going to be real curious to see how fast this, uh, you know, can just heat up some water uh, in a comparison with the the original flash system here. So uh, we're going to get right into it. I'm going to get uh, get some butane put on here and get it uh, lit up, and uh, we'll go through the flash system first, and then uh, then we'll jump over to the Mighty Mo. All right, guys. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and crank up the uh, the jet boil here and um, turn that gas up and that thing's going and uh, we're gonna see how long it takes for it to boil I mean I'm going to assume that uh, this is not going to boil water as fast as the uh, the mighty mo here uh, just given the fact that at 4,500 BTUs versus 10,000, that, that's a big difference. Now at a minute, you can kind of look down there and see the, uh, you're starting to see the bubbles come off of the base. So it's getting close. I'm pretty sure here in uh, probably the next 20 seconds, we'll have about a full rolling boil.
Okay, well, we've definitely passed the, uh, the 20 second mark. And we are just now at the, uh, the two minute mark. And we are at uh, just over two and three quarter. All right, so we got a full boil at right at two minutes, 58 seconds. So we just say three minutes, you're boiling water with the jet boil, with the jet boil flash system. All right, guys, so everything's cooled down. Uh, and we have the Mighty Mo hooked up to it. So we're going to go ahead, crank up the Mighty Mo, and see what happens. Wow, so I'm sure you can hear that just as well as I can. This thing sounds uh, quite a bit like a beast. It is a lot louder than the uh, regular jet boil flash. Uh, it does sit a little bit higher. I don't know if I would actually use this with my jet boil cup. Uh, probably more with a, uh, a pot or a pan than, uh, than actually using it with the cup. But I mean, this thing is, uh, this thing's got a considerable amount of power to it. Definitely way more than uh, the flash itself. I'm actually pretty surprised to, uh, to see this much coming out of it. So right now we're at about 47 seconds and the water is, uh, it's definitely moving around in there. And uh, at this rate, I'm hoping that uh, I just don't run out of fuel before this thing goes. I mean, this thing's, this thing's actually just burning through the fuel. All right, there it is, a full boil at one minute and 30, basically a minute and 30 seconds. So let me go ahead and back this all the way down. I'd, uh, I'm pretty impressed with that. I honestly wasn't expecting this. I thought it was just jet boil kind of trying to move into another market and throwing something out there that's been made a million times over. But, um, I mean, I really, really am impressed. A minute and 30 seconds this thing boiled, and I'm sure as you could, you could hear it as well as I could, this tank right here was probably running out of fuel. It was actually stepping down uh, about 45, uh, 50 seconds into it, and this still brought it to a full boil in 130 seconds versus the, or excuse me, a minute and 30 seconds versus the, uh, the three minutes. So, I mean, it, it cut it in half. All right, guys. Well, there you have it. Uh, side by side with a jet boil flash, the uh, the jet boil Mighty Mo is uh, it's something else. I didn't expect that myself. Um, I mean, double the boil time. Thing is a real powerhouse. Uh, like I said before, I really thought it was just jet boil, um, just jumping into a uh, you know a market, just rehashing something that everybody else has put out there. But I mean, the thing's a real powerhouse. Whether I would use it with a jet boil cup, I don't know, just because of the height. Um, 
was stacking the cup on top of this and uh, the height of it, not really having a, an attachment ring. I probably wouldn't use it with my jet boil cup, but you know, I would definitely use this with a pan or a pot to, you know, boil water to cook food on. It's definitely got the power for it. Um, you know, not a lot more I could say about it. Uh, I mean, you see it with your own eyes. It's a, uh, it's a really good stove, packs a lot of power behind it. You know, check it out. It's on Amazon. It's about $43. Um, you know, you decide if it works for you, uh, if that's what you want to get. I mean, but personally, I, you know, I think it's a good product. Hey guys, I hope you liked the video. And if you did, please feel free to hit that like button or subscribe. You can also find me on Pinterest, Facebook, Instagram, UncleBillsCamping.com, and of course, right here on YouTube. And from Uncle Bill's Camping, this is Patrick, and thank you for taking the time to look at my video.